I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say all the elements because I think they want to have this major big surprise for the community. Uh, but you know, um, one of the premise that uh, we really had was to um, transform the library into pages of the Marie Sendak Where the Wild Things Are. Um, we wanted to make sure that um, the exhibition is immersive and also educational at the same time. Um, um, there's a, a big historical component to the exhibition, especially on the 50 works that's going to be exhibited um, in the gallery space. Um, but along with that, we also were catering to um, uh, children uh, and adults and how to engage them in the conversation about the book, um, about the story. Um, and so I think everyone is pretty much familiar with the story of Where the Wild Things Are and um, Where is Senda. But there's a lot more to the author that others don't know. Um, you know, for example, I didn't know he illustrated hundreds of books and uh, written other stories, um, um, you know, besides where the, where the wild things are. So, um, you know, the, so there's a lot to see and there's a lot to do and, uh, you know, um, it's been really engaging, collaborating with the uh, uh, the public library and uh, and everyone in the crew has been so uh, helpful and supportive um, and uh, so I'm very lucky to have this opportunity.